what's going on guys living zombies here back with another pokemon go video and in today's video guys we are talking about how to catch zarud during of course the verdant wonders event so do remember guys this is not the debut of zarud zarud actually did come out a few years ago and it was available for free uh if you guys were playing back then but of course if you guys want to catch zarud during this event you will have to make your way into the shop and buy the ticket for zarud for eight years us dollars so once you guys do buy that ticket the event does start on thursday march 21st at 10 a.m local time and these are the research steps for the zarud do remember this is a special research so therefore it's not timed you guys can take your time on doing this research once you guys do load into the game and get that research on your account so page one guys is complete five research tasks catch 25 grass type pokemon evolve three grass type pokemon for two silver pineapple berries a c dot encounter 20 pokeballs and a thousand dust 10 raspberries and two tms so again these challenges are not going to be too hard and the rewards are kind of going to be a little mediocre as well uh page two is walk five kilometers catch 25 dark, dark type pokemon evolve three dark type pokemon for two golden raspberries a galar ziggy encounter 10 great balls a thousand dust five hypers and two charge tms page three spend 25 pokestops or gems power up five grass type pokemon make an excellent throw for two silver pineapple berries a cacnea encounter 10 ultra balls a thousand dust five revives one incense page four we're almost there guys use five super effective charge attacks not hard either power up five dark type pokemon use 10 berries to help catch pokemon two golden raspberries scraggy and five rare candies with a thousand xp two premium passes and a thousand dust and then on page five is the page where you guys will be catching zarud win three raids so you will have to use those passes that you just got on page four um catch 15 different species of pokemon defeat five team go rocket grunts for two silver pineapps absol encounter 10 zarud candy a thousand dust and that encounter with zarud with three xl candy for the zarud as well now is it worth it to buy this ticket i mean if you if you already have a zarud it's probably not worth the eight us dollars or whatever the price is in your country guys it's probably not going to be worth it there is another bonus to this which is increased incense spawns of these pokemon right here to so the elemental monkeys the flabebes which do remember they do still remain region locked so if you guys are in the states you're just going to be incensing that yellow flabebe or of course the white slash orange flower flabebe and cottony and zorua so i did use an incense not too long ago during the event in new zealand and the incense spawns were okay i mean sometimes you got some puchiana spawns or some other random spawn like one time i had a rapidash spawn so you're not going to get those spawns every single time the flabebe spawns could have been a little better off the incense too but i will say the zorua spawns off the incense were pretty good that was one of the most common spawns i was getting off of my incense so again if you guys already have a zarud this probably isn't worth it to you to be honest but if you are missing zarud you might want to get this because who knows when this will come back to the game and this is a mythical pokemon if you like collecting every single pokemon that gets released into the game then yeah i guess you might want to buy this if you guys don't want to miss out on the pokedex so again guys that is how you get zarud during this event do remember when the event is over that ticket for zarud will leave the shop now let's talk about costumes cottony guys yes the shiny is out for the costume cottony and you are able to evolve it into whimsicott too if you guys are lucky enough to find one now how do you go about finding a costumed shiny cottony well it is a featured spawn and the spawn rate for it was pretty decent i would say it's like in the middle it's not one of the most common spawns but it's definitely not like the rarest spawn i would say the rarest spawn is probably zorua to be honest or maybe the elemental monkeys so yeah you can find it in the wild but it also is in field research but there is some bad news it does share an encounter pool with two other pokemon so the walk one kilometer task explore one kilometer task can give you either a vulpix meryl or the costumed cottony so it is pulled together uh if you guys are looking for that in field research so yeah guys that is how you go about catching zarud in this pokemon go event let me know in the comment section below guys if you will be buying a ticket to catch zarud during this event let me know down below guys thank you so much for watching today's video if you enjoyed drop a like in the video subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in the next one peace